Okay, that should be good. So, let's do it. And we're, uh, we'll, uh, we'll show this off. So, let's see where our uh, requests are. We have one in here. So let's start here. And both of these bosses are confusable. So I think what we'll, you know, I don't want to spend too much time. Because this won't necessarily be the most exciting thing ever. And we don't have any new parts of Mementos to explore right now. But, well, you know, so we'll, we'll run through this real quick. We'll get some money off each of the bosses before we put them out of their misery. And then we'll move on. I have something. Can they get me up here? Oh yeah, they can. Okay. And these guys should all be extremely low level. Yeah, they're super low level. These are freaking, uh... These are like Madarame's palace enemies. Not even Madarame, I think these are like Kamoshida palace enemies. So these guys are weak as shit. Okay. We're gonna try and avoid. We're gonna try and avoid combat as much as possible, so we don't waste time fighting these little, little babby, babby shadows here. I think this should be the way down. Oh, come on, don't hit me. Oh, he got me. <laughs> oh no, they flipped over the motor car. Super sad. All right, guys, give me your best shot. <laughs> oh, I forgot, these guys are strong and physical. Shouldn't have turned Rush on, but that's all right. <laughs> all right, come on, guys. All right. I guess we're going to get this over with. Captain Kid! Come on, Ryuji. What the heck you doing? Let's go, Captain! Nice going, Skull! Want it? Bye! No time to waste! A spectacular victory! Okay, so okay. we just need to we need to find this boss. Which is not on this floor, so we're just trying to prioritize finding the exit here. Which is not in here. Joker. So I'm going the totally wrong way. These are both dead ends. Let's keep moving. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, this road's so bumpy. I can feel it. Oh, we missed the end of Mona's creepy voice line. Oh, come on. Get out of here. Waste my time fighting this little, little babby guys here. Around here somewhere. There's only like two floors left here, so it's got to be real close. Uh, I don't even know if it's worth the lockpick. This is a pretty low-level chest, but <laughs> we'll crack it open, I guess. Yeah, I think that's pretty shitty. Let's see. Pretty sure that is not very good. Eh, it's all right, I guess. What does Ryuji have? On strength, there's this rage. That's Ryuji. Anyway, just keep on moving here. We'll find the way out of here. It's got to be on like the next floor, I think. There's only two floors left until the end, so it should be very soon. And we'll get to give this a whirl. Yeah, it's got to be on this floor, right? Yeah. Okay. This is the last actually explorable floor. So let's see where our guy is. Looks like he should be right up this way. Yeah, there he is. Okay. So here we go. And basically, all we're gonna do is we're gonna confuse this boss and we're gonna guard <laughs> and just let him keep throwing money at us. Oh. 
and then we'll, yes. we'll put him out of his misery once we've decided we got enough cash off of him. So... That's our boy Sandman, we got 31 luck. Did I give brother the luck item? Yes. Okay. Here we go. I mean, with Confuse Boost and the Palinpa, we should get pretty much 100% chance to confuse this guy. Huh? I'm just all messed up, you know. I'll show you. All right. I'm honestly curious to see how much money we'll end up getting off of this. Persona. Oh, okay. <laughs> Is this guy still weak to gun? Yep. And Oni probably has no weaknesses, I'm guessing. Let's just hit him with, uh... No and we don't want to kill the boss. We just wanted to hand us over all his money. So... Let's see if we can take care of the little guy. Ah, so close. How the heck did we not kill that little bastard? And he's gonna take all our SP. What a dick. Okay. Let's try again. There we go. Okay, got him. So what we wanna do now is let's uh let's finish off the little the little guy and the big guy. And then that'll just leave us the boss. So I'm pretty sure this guy is strong to physical. If he's like Oni. But we're not really sure. Let's give it a whirl. Yeah. Kind of a waste. Show me the money. Yeah. Ah, uh, 43,000 a turn. So that's definitely... That is not bad at all. Uh, let's... Let's top everybody off. Kaguya. All right. I appreciate it. Oh, that's a big help. Thanks. Persona! Let's finish off this guy. So he stops taking us around. What's up next? Come on. Okay. This should be enough to finish him, hopefully. And then we'll just be us and the boss. So you can't keep applying Confuse once you're already confused, so we just gotta guard and wait for his turn. It's, he won't throw money every turn, unfortunately. There we go, got him. And then, so this is it, this is basically, this is it. But I mean, basically all the money we, we spent making Sandman, we've already made it back. Like, just one turn made back all the money we spent on on building up Sandman. It's like, as you get more luck, you'll get even more money. Ah, uh, look at all that yen. I think he's going to recover this turn. It's usually, I think it's three turns. So he's going to do something this turn, and then we'll hit him again, and then just keep going. And then once we, once we get like, you know, I don't know, we'll do this a few more times. Uh, hmm. 
Because we still have one more boss in here to fight, too. Like, if I can get, like, five, six hundred thousand yen, I'll be happy with that. That should be plenty for right now. So, we'll, we'll do this more later on. And we'll come back, like, the next time we do this, we'll do it with a much beefier persona, with a higher luck stat. And then we'll end up getting, like, I think you can get, like, 150,000 a turn if you have a high enough luck stat. So it'll be a much quicker, it'll be a much quicker uh, farming trip the next time around. This is basically just to get us a little nest egg. So we can, uh, so we can come back and do this again later. So we've already gotten, I think, 150,000 yen. We'll get, like, we'll get another 150k and then we'll call it quits, I think, on this guy. And then we'll farm the next guy a little bit too, and then that'll be it. So I'd like to do, uh, I'd like to still get Makoto's social link started today. A couple other things. Man, he's just dropping the money, though. Greed might take over. I'm a little tempted. Let's go. Hmm. Yeah, this is going pretty well, I would say. I wish you could check your money while you're in, while you're in combat, so I can see how much we've gotten. I know this is uh, this is riveting gameplay, <laughs> but it's for a good cause, I promise. Because we are we are cleaning up on the money right now. Yeah, so we we've missed once. I think we've confused him like five times. We've only missed once with our with our confused boost. So this is a pretty good combo. And basically the reason the reason we use Sandman is because Sandman has like the highest base luck stat at this level by far. Most personas in, in the 20s level wise have like maybe 10, 15 luck. But obviously this guy this guy started out with a much higher base stat, so he's a, he's a good one to start with in terms of uh, your farming persona. But there'll be better ones later on. Once this confusion's over, we'll put him out of his misery. Oh, we got an item that time. Well, we still have one more boss to kill. I think we already got like 300k off of this guy, roughly. One more. Come on, give me some money. Ah, alright, that's fine. We'll just kill him. I don't want to spend too much more time. So, let's give him the, let's give him the gun. Oh, he's weak to gun. Nice. Oh, no, we just crit. Can I take his money, too? I don't think you can negotiate with these guys. <laughs> Alright. Let's get him. And so we still have one more boss we can do this on. So, we'll, uh, we'll farm the next boss a little bit, too. And then... That'll probably be where we call it for now. I don't see any reason for us to spend too much time on this the first time around. We'll come, like, we can get 100k a turn, we'll come back and do this again. I just kind of wanted to show it off, and I also, well, I want the money, because i got to buy some SP adhesives. <laughs> so. so, that's one down. And then we have one, uh, we have one boss left in the next section. Uh, 
We'll head back to the entrance and then we'll head down to the next section. And we'll take care of our last request in here. Oh yeah, I wanna, I wanna check our money. Let's see how we're doing. Yeah, I think we still I think we got like 300k off of that. So I mean that was what 10 minutes? Yeah, 10 minutes. And we got almost 400,000 yen. I think we started in there. I think we went in after we fused Sandman with 100k. So we just got 400,000 yen in like 10 minutes of work. So, uh not too shabby is what I'm trying to say here. So, let's hit up the next boss. We'll save in the in the rest area and then figure out if we need to go up or down. Okay, we gotta go up. I wonder if we're better off just go and start the first floor. Let's see. If he's not on this floor, we might just start from the first floor. We might end up having to go through more if we start this way. Yeah, I don't know. Let's uh, let's run back up. We'll start from. The beginning. I think I think it's closer to the beginning than it's closer to the Hi, middle. Let's rip. So yeah, let's start from here. I like the mementos theme, even though it's uh it's pretty simple, but it's it's kind of like relaxing when you're in here farming. I know a lot of people don't like mementos. I know people who have played... Oh yeah, he's right on this floor. I know people who have played like 3 and 4 always complain that they hated the randomly generated dungeons and they liked the palaces so much more because, you know, they're like handcrafted and everything. But honestly, I, I really like the randomly generated dungeons personally. I mean, I, I love the palaces too, don't get me wrong. Uh, I really do enjoy the palaces. They did a great job on pretty much all of them. But, uh, I don't mind just the, the random dungeon crawler part either. So, Mementos is cool with me. Alright. Let's find our boss. Oh, he should be, like, maybe right over this way. Oh, there's a chest. Yes, yeah, so we'll find our boss. It's like, we'll get... If we can get, like, another 500,000, that'll put us over a million yen already. And that'll probably be a good place to... Like, I don't think we'll need much more money than that for the time being. So, that'll probably be a good good place to stop farming. Uh, that's pretty decent. I'll give her that. What does On have? I guess we'll hand On's over to... Or we'll give On Makoto's armor for now. So let's find this boss, and we're gonna take all his shit. We're gonna completely empty this guy's wallet out. <laughs> On the Tara. Ice. This guy's gonna get to move first, huh? He's not strong physically. And these are these are low level enemies. It's like I said, this is uh These guys are not really a threat to us. Good work on. Okay, we should have Bufu on somebody, I hope. Let's go. Uh, let me see. Yeah. Sandman. The boss should be like right down around this corner. I think this map is not being very helpful. Right here? Right here. Okay. Oh. Yeah, this is the manager who's uh 
who's embezzling his own business and blaming it on his employees. Huh? All right, let's take care of this guy. So, I guess the alternate title for the stream would be, like, uh, who would win? One, one Memento's boss or one sleepy boy? <laughs> and the answer is one sleepy boy. So, let's, go. let's see if we can hit him first try. There. Yep. And now we just wait patiently. Again, I'm sorry. I know this is not the most riveting gameplay on the planet, but we'll we'll only do this for a couple minutes. I want to get like, another couple hundred thousand yen, and then uh... oh, he's even throwing away SP recovery items. That's great. But yeah, so we'll get a couple more hundred, a couple more hundred thousand yen ish, and then uh, we'll just kill him. It's for a good cause. It's gonna help us get some super super badass personas later on. Uh, there goes our accuracy. Hopefully we can still land a confuse. Your agility's down. Do I have a Persona? Uh, uh let's just guard. Uh we'll just let her hit him. We'll soften him up a little so we can kill him easier when we're done. Oh, you resist physical, huh? Persona. Speed's been lowered. Right. Shit. See, the fucking... The stem, uh... This accuracy debuff is gonna ruin everything. Uh... I don't have... We can use this. It's, it's almost a waste, but... I don't think we actually have the, the skill yet to dispel debuffs, like stat debuffs. So we're kind of just stuck doing it with that. Alright, come on, give me a confusion. Come on. Christ. They're gonna make this take they're gonna make this take longer than I wanted it to take. Uh, we'll just soften them up a little bit, I guess. We soften him up a lot there, actually. I don't wanna I don't wanna hit him too much more. Come on. Give me the confuse. Jesus Christ. Oh, you know, I wonder if it's because he was uh, I wonder if it's because we, we made him dizzy. I don't know if he can uh, I don't know if they can have more than one status ailment at a time. Now that I think about it, that might have been why I wasn't landing. Hopefully now. There we go. All right, show me the money, buddy. There we go, forty thousand. Give me some more. Uh, just keep waiting. He's still charged. <laughs> I guess, I think charge stays until he actually gets a swing. So he's still gonna get a charge attack. But he can't really hurt us too bad. Okay, let's hit him. There we go. Man, he's not dropping, he's not dropping as often as the other guy was. So the random chances you have is either when they're confused, they either just lose a turn, or they drop money, or they drop an item. We're getting more items than anything else. I mean, I can't complain about the soul drop too much because they are they are SP recovery items. So I mean that's good, but I really just want to get the money so we can uh, so we can keep moving here. Oh, my God. 
Yeah, we've only I think he's only dropped money once so far. Damn. <laughs> it's we're not we're not having the greatest luck on this time around, unfortunately. Oh, we'll keep at it for a little bit longer. So I don't wanna waste I don't wanna waste a ton of time on this right now. Jesus, he's not gonna drop shit. That's two turns in a row with nothing. So this one this one is not going our way. The thing is basically not every boss is confusable in mementos. Uh, I mean a lot of them are, but not all of them. So while we have the opportunity now, I want to take advantage of it. And then we'll come back later. And by later I mean probably a good bit later. If we can get our hands on a million yen now, that should be enough to last us a long time. Like, quite a long time. But then later on, we'll come back and when, you know, we can get like 100k a turn, we'll farm a shitload, and then we'll be able to, uh, we're gonna use that cash to farm up some super beefy personas. This is all, this is all a good bit later on. I'm kind of getting a little bit ahead of myself here, but that's okay. Oh, come on, man. I just want the money. It's making this a lot more difficult than the other boss was. Maybe we just got really lucky the first time around. Because, man, that first boss, he was throwing money out there like, like no other. There we go. I could check my money while we're, while we're in the fight. And we are definitely we're gonna take some of this money and uh, we're gonna get the uh, we're gonna get the SP adhesives for Makoto. And I, I mean we'll buy one for Ryuji too, I guess. Ryuji shouldn't be casting too much, but we'll hook him up with one because we're gonna we're definitely gonna have the money for it. So there's no real reason not to. I can't remember the name of the shadow when he's not a boss. Uh, I don't think it's like Ku Chulain. I can't remember. Satanta? That's, maybe sounds right. A couple more rounds of this. He seems to be getting more generous with the cash. Yeah, that's what I like to see. Plus, we get to listen to the we get to listen to the mini boss battle theme. Which, this is one of my favorite tracks in the whole game. I love this tune. So at least we get some we get some chill music while we're at it. Ah, uh, he's just, he's freaking, the dollar bills are raining down now. Oops. Are you guys sick of hearing where, where are my lord's enemies yet? Yeah, this is finally going well though, so I kind of want to, kind of want to keep it rolling. I, I forget how many times he's dropped money so far. I think at least four, maybe five. So we probably should have another 200k sitting in our, sitting in the bank right now. So if we can get a few more, if we can get a few more, I'll be happy. Because we're going to spend another 100k on SP adhesives when we're out of here. Ah, uh, fucking accuracy debuff. I don't think anybody can get rid of those yet without using an item. Which kind of sucks. We'll just use it. Okay. Yeah, because I, I just don't want to leave the accuracy debuff on. It's going to make it even harder to land Confuse, and it's just going to make this take even longer. So, we'll just we'll just keep going. It's kind of a waste to use that item here, but it's all right. Where are my lord's enemies? <laughs> More money? Nah. We're up to five or six cash drops, though. Hmm. 
Yeah, he's not really, he's not making much of a dent. Uh, brother's gonna be out of SP soon anyway, so. One way or the other, this is gonna end sooner rather than later. Alright. We've had a pretty good hit chance with our Confuse, though. I think we've only missed, like, twice the entire time on both bosses, so. With our Lux stat and the Confuse boost, this, this is working pretty well, for sure. Alright, come on, give me money again. Ah. All right, two more, two more rounds of confusion, and then we'll we'll call it. We'll just put him out of his misery. We've already taken a ton of his money. Let's go. Hope everybody's having fun. Come on, we only get a few more chances of this. Give me a little bit more cash. Ah, oh, come on, that's two in a row. He didn't do shit. He didn't even give us an item. Alright, come on. One good round of confusion. Damn, three in a row. He hasn't dropped anything. This, this is gonna be it though. This is gonna be the last round. If we don't get anything more this time, that's fine. Wow, that's four in a row he didn't drop shit. It sucks pretty bad. Uh, let's just guard. We'll let him use his charge up and then we'll, we'll take him down. I mean, I guess we can keep confusing him and while wow, we're beating the shit out of him and hope we'll drop a little more money before the end. So I guess we'll do that. I don't think he's going to live too much longer. <laughs> yeah, we'll give him one more. We'll give him one more Confuse and then we'll finish him off. I'm just hoping I can get a, a little bit more cash. There we go. Uh, just melee him. Oh, I think he's strong and physical. Yeah. Oh, he's real close. All right, we'll let him. We'll let him get his last turn in, and then we'll, we'll finish him off. That's not it. Uh, where's my boy, Kinky? There he is. Kinky. That's not right. All right, come on. Shit. All right, we'll just kill him. We still did okay there. <laughs> yeah, we're we're done now. We should be we should be in pretty good shape. Money wise. I don't think we quite hit a million yen. I mean, it's still, it wasn't too long, really. We've only been in mementos for like half an hour, maybe. And we didn't spend all that time on the bosses, we still had to find them. So let's say like 20, 25 minutes, we got a good chunk of money. Got a book. All right, so let's see how we're doing here. Yeah. Uh, no, we're done here. All of our all of our requests are finished. And since the the change of heart hasn't happened yet, we don't have any new parts of Mementos to explore. We did pretty good though, 881k. Uh, I'll take that and be happy. Absolutely. It was all thanks to it was all thanks to Moon Boy here. <laughs> he hooked us up heavy. Okay, so we are done do in it. Mementos. We're gonna save all our ill-gotten gains and then we're gonna we're gonna head out of here. So we still have like two weeks until Kanashiro's change of heart. I. Uh, I definitely want to get started on Makoto's social link. I think we should be able to start that, I believe. Ah, you're back. So I think that'll be what we do 
tomorrow, potentially. We can't do anything else tonight. We have a ton of stuff that needs washed, too. We need to, uh... We need to make use of Kawakami. Since she can finally do our laundry. Hey. So, we'll call her up on one of these nights. And we'll see if we got any, uh... We'll see if we got any decent armor. to hang today on um, we'd rank up the doctor on's not ready to rank up yet I think uh, let's see what's today Sunday oh uh, Sunday okay before we do anything else we need to go to the juice bar get our stat boost especially now that 5,000 yen that ain't even gonna hurt us at all We are flush with cash. Look at all that money. Okay, I think uh, I think Makoto's just hanging out at the school. Even on, even on her day off, she hangs out at the school. <laughs> She's such a good student. But, let's see. I think we might still be too dumb to hang out with her, actually. Hey. Hmm? Mm. Ah, let's see. Do you have a minute? Okay, we are smart enough. Um. Okay, let's start it. Thank you very much. I definitely want to get her baton pass unlocked, because Makoto is going to be in our party for probably the rest of the game. So we need to start working on her abilities hey, in battle. I have a question to ask you. Is that okay? Up until now, I've been the quintessential honor student. First time through, uh, I picked Makoto for waifu, but I I, I don't think we're going to do Makoto this time. As student council president with ease as well. But Makoto is cool. And I don't mean that in a boasting way. That's simply how I've thought about it. But in the end, I was unable to make any kind of impact. Like she's really, Yusuke she's awkward. Son, but Kanashiro. I think Makoto had one of the best, no uh, for a rule abiding honor one of the best social links, at least in my well. opinion. Now that I'm a member of this team, I want she to starts out very unlikable in the beginning. But she has, uh, she has pretty good progression. Kept me quite narrow-minded. I think I will need to broaden my horizon somewhat. My first step will be to learn more about the other students. But I struggle with that. There seems to be a disparity between my tastes and those of my peers. Makoto's <laughs> Makoto's not hip with the with the young kids these days. I knew it. I don't even know where people like to go for fun. It would be nice to have a grasp of such concepts. Plus, the student council must be responsible. <laughs> Makoto's social link is basically showing Makoto how to be a normal human. Serve, right? <laughs> I don't mean that in a surveillance way. I just want to know them as people. I may be a phantom thief, but that's no excuse for me to start ignoring my presidential duties. Now, back to the topic at hand. Where do people usually go for fun? Uh, let's take her to the arcade. Uh, I often hear people talking about going to the arcade. To be perfectly honest, I've never been to one myself. Do you think you could take me? I'm not sure if it'll broaden my It's horizons, pretty hard to find an actual arcade these days, I think, anyway. I think, uh... Thank I think they're still more common in Japan. Because I think if you actually go totally to, like, uh... Oh my god, myself. I can't remember what, like, the nerd trap area of Tokyo is. But we'll unlock it later. But I think, really, I think in actual, like, in real... Real Tokyo in the nerd station, there's, like, a whole bunch of these things still. Like, real actual arcades. Let's get going. So you can go sit there and like play Metal Slug on a real cabinet.
So this is where everyone comes to enjoy themselves. There are more girls here than I expected. Hey, over there! You play by aiming the gun at the screen, right? That actually seems somewhat realistic. Hmm. I if it's okay with you, do you think you could teach me? I did it! <laughs> oh, so this is how it is. Of course, that was just a game. But I wonder if I could apply some of the techniques I learned here during battle. Going somewhere I don't normally frequent is what helped me come up with that idea. You know, it may only be a little bit, but I think I'm starting to understand how people pass time. Interesting. I would have never even thought about coming here before. Okay, so this should be the start of I... Makoto's. Makoto's uh, priestess. Hey, do you think you could help me out again later? I might be able to give the team more ideas. And then tonight we're gonna make sure uh, knowledge outside of my studies. Tonight we're gonna make sure we hand Kawakami over our all our laundry. And then we'll figure out who we wanna hang with. Oh, we can start the uh, we can start the fortune social link too. In uh, Shinjuku. Maybe maybe that's where we'll go tonight. I need to live up to your expectations now that I've See it's good we got all this money, because you need a hundred thousand yen to get started on the fortune social link. So Perhaps it won't be immediately, but I'm sure I can be of use. We're already going to be cashing out all this money we made. we got to buy two adhesives, and then we'll start Chihaya's. So that'll be 200k down the drain right there. There must have been people who obstructed your actions as the Phantom Thieves. Like, so you figure, uh... Kanashiro's entire palace. You had someone who specialized in analyzing enemies. Kanashiro's entire palace made us like a hundred thousand right? yen. So in twenty minutes in mementos, we made seven hundred, almost eight hundred k. It shall become the wings of rebellion. And when we come back later, way later, with the birth of the priestess persona, we'll be able to really clean up. I in have there. obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. So I don't know. We'll right. do. Uh, we'll do some more social links and stuff. We have a lot of time left anyway, until the change of heart. You went to the red light district when you were chasing after Kanashiro, right? I'd like to go there as well. No, not for my own purposes. To tell you the truth, I recently got a report that one of our students was spotted there. I'm skeptical, but I'd like to confirm firsthand for myself. At least she's done creeping on us and she's ready to creep on someone else now. I think we should. Yeah. It was pretty funny when Makoto was still spying on us to see if we were the Phantom Thieves. I didn't even notice my first time through. I, I noticed the second playthrough. But so if you're if you go to the school and you walk around the school, or if you go and walk around Central Street in Shibuya, uh, sometimes Makoto will follow you with a book held up to her face like this. Like if you turn around and look at her, she'll she'll hide her face behind the book and she'll follow you around Shibuya. Oh, and we have the uh, we have the home shopping channel tonight too, ah, you're back. so we can buy some crap maybe. This is when we sent Mishima to the to the drunk ass reporter in exchange for info on Kanashiro. <laughs> you think Ryuji would fall for that? <laughs> yep. Maybe. Alright. 
So. So we can start the, uh, the reporter is a social link, and now we can start that, too. I really don't, I really don't think her social link is that useful. It's just, uh, in general, I think the reporter is the weakest character. Like, I, I find the reporter pretty annoying. And, uh... Her abilities basically just let you lower the security level in a palace when you're outside of the palace. But so if you're doing the palace in one day, her ability is never going to be useful. And unless you're getting seen by enemies all the time, you're pretty much never going to need her to lower the security level for you. Plus, she's got to sit there and listen to the, the lady putting on her best drunk impression. And it's just a... It doesn't do much for me. I didn't spend a lot of time with her the first time, and I probably won't this time either. Yeah. So, this is just Mishima talking about our mementos request that we did. Yeah. And uh, so we can hang out with the politician tonight. We may, we may do that. I'm gonna go give Kawakami our laundry first, and we're gonna buy some. Uh, uh, these are just gifts. But, sure. We're, we're flush with cash. We don't need it. So I think we'll hang out with the politician tonight, though. And if I'm not mistaken, we may actually be ready to... Whoops. Oh, wait. That is right. That's what I wanted to check. Yeah, he's going to rank up. And if I remember right, the next rank with him, I think, will actually give us a chance to get a shortcut for actually getting a persona. Oh no, it's just for items. But yeah, we'll hang out with him. So before we hang out with him, let's look and see. Can't remember. Where's all our dirty laundry? So we have. Yeah. So I think they're they're worst to best. So this is the shittiest gear. So the gold tarnished acrylic, and we'll give her one grimy. We'll let Kawakami do our laundry. And then we'll go hang out with our politician buddy and see what he's up to. I'll just add this. And I don't even think we haven't even shown this off yet. Hey, hey. But so you can find you can find dirty equipment in mementos or in the palaces. And then uh, it basically just becomes a random a random piece of armor. I mean random in like tears. So the, the gold armor we just threw in there is definitely going to be better than the grimy armor. So we'll throw four in here. And then we'll let Kawakami handle this shit. Just make our high school teacher wash our clothes for us. Hi. <laughs> if anybody hasn't gotten to see the, the fan service Kawakami in a maid outfit yet, there you go. So she just sits here and she just sits here and does our laundry. <laughs> All right. Uh, so let's go see our boy Tora. Oh, hold on. Sorry, I keep making pet stops here. We're gonna buy our SP adhesives as well. Please head to the exam room.
Yeah, we already have two. I see. We're just gonna buy two more. And then we'll be, effective. we'll be good. This will work well. Here you go. And then, yeah, the rest of these. Why do you have such a serious look on your face? We don't really we don't need any of this stuff. So now everybody, everybody gets SP back, which is pretty great. Say. This is this is definitely one of the most useful items. Uh, basically until the end game. This is like a complete game changer, palace wise. So on, Makoto, Ryuji, and brother. Yep. We are all loaded up. And we still have three quarters of a million left. Okay, so tonight we're gonna hang out with Tora. But I think, uh, I think tomorrow... I think tomorrow night we'll go to Shinjuku and we'll try and get the, uh... We'll try and get the fortune link unlocked. We're, we're making good progress on these social links. I think we still, off the top of my head, I can remember... The most important thing. Is oh, I think at least four more that we have to unlock. I... Actually, yeah, like four or five more, I think, that we have to that we don't have unlocked yet. Knock them dead, Tora. Turned over a new leaf. He's a, he's a reformed man, and he wants to just help. He wants to save Japan. He's our cool cool politics dad. I think our next skill from Tora should be uh, at rank seven, and that one will actually that'll let us skip the whole like negotiation process, the whole question and answer to actually recruit a persona. I mean, not every time; it's it's random chance. But yes, yeah, so then you don't have to negotiate at all, which is <laughs> that's going to be a lifesaver for me because I suck at it. Hmm. Guts too. Well, I'll see you again. I want to. Uh, I want to get a Y unlocked. We'll have to keep an eye out for. Maybe we'll do some DVDs one of these nights. Hi. Oh yeah, Kawakami. Give me that. Give me that laundry. We got some maybe decent stuff. We'll have to take a look and see what all that is.
Hmm. Yes. Today might be a good day for a little bit of studying, too, if it's going to keep raining. Maybe depending on who wants to hang out in the afternoon. So sorry. Refers to rain. Good. I mean, I guess that one seems obvious for like a native English speaker, but I mean, these are these are normally it's it's in Japanese. So I guess if you're in Japan and you're playing this game in Japanese and they're asking about you know what the hell do these crazy Americans say about it raining cats and dogs? I guess it's maybe more of a confusing question. Okay, so let's see who wants to hang after school today. Uh, Use K. I really want to. <laughs> I really don't want to hang out with Use K. Uh, I mean, it wouldn't hurt though. So he's he's all we have today for an option anyway. So I guess we'll hang out with Use K. Um, before we do that though, we're gonna raid all the vending machines again. So we have Backstreet, Shibuya, and we also have Shinjuku now that we can hit up. Mm, it's so, humid. so we'll stock up on SP sodas really fast. Oh, I forgot too. Forgot about our new armor. So what do we got here? Ah, uh, that's pretty nice. Three agility. Uh, two endurance. Let's give Brother the Agility one. Actually, we should probably really keep... Because this one, the girls can wear too. So let's give Makoto... The Agility one. And we'll give on... Wow, five strength. Uh, never mind. We'll give Makoto the five strength. She actually has some decent, uh... She actually has some decent physical attacks versus on. So we'll give her the robe. And I think we will let Brother have the agility item. And we'll give Ryuji the plate vest. Yeah, okay. So everybody's got decent gear on, actually. Let's see, uh, let's see how much strength Makoto has with that on. That's pretty decent. Yeah, 23. That's not bad at all. That's, uh, more than Brother and Ryuji. So, yeah, not too shabby. So let's get the, uh, well, we'll get Shibuya when we go see Yusuke. I guess maybe we could sell Yusuke out. We can see if the fortune teller, I think the fortune teller is only at night though, if I remember right. buying some. These are just gifts for when we're hanging out. But we'll hang on to them. Um, okay. 
Check. I think these are the other vending machines. Let's see what the fortune teller is up to. I'm not sure... I'm not sure if we can hang out with her during the day. I'm pretty sure... Whoops, I went too far. Pretty sure it's at night. I think she'd be set up in the alleyway back here. Yeah, I think she'd be set up, like, right here. And she's not here right now. So I guess it is going to be us and use Kate tonight. Or... We can see what movie's playing. Mm, you know what? We're going to... We're gonna sell out use can't go to the movies. We could use the guts. So we can maybe get um, we can get started on the gun shop guy. So sorry, use K. I'd rather go to the movies by myself than hang out with you. You try to cut ties with me, then you come back for more. I'll kill you! Boss! Boss! No! That bastard shot him! Boss! Snake! Come on, give me that guts. Uh, we gotta be getting close to leveling that up. All right. We've been chugging lots of coffee while we're studying, so... Gotta be getting there. So maybe nighttime is. We'll, we'll go back and check. Rain, huh? You know, come to think of it, though, I'm not sure if she's ever even out there while it's raining. So we'll, we'll go back and check and see if the fortune teller's out. Oh, and this will. This is another social link that they're laying on us here. Hafumi. She's way too smart to date Ryuji. <laughs> Such a weirdo. Okay. Uh, so maybe, we, yeah. So we got we got a couple of things we can start on. Uh, we have Hifumi. And we also have Chihaya, which is the fortune teller. Uh, we are ready to rank up with Sochiro, too. Let's, let's, let's see what our options are, and then we'll decide what we want to do here. Sochiro is ready to rank up. Can't do anything with a Y yet. The fortune teller, oh no, that's the reporter. I'm definitely not worried about the reporter. Um, well, let's go, oh, I forgot to hit up the arcade. Let's do that real quick. We'll scope out the fortune teller. If the fortune teller's not there, I think we'll, uh, if the fortune teller's not there, I think we'll do Sojiro, I guess. Maybe we'll do Fumi. I don't know. It's, you know, I spent the first couple hours we were playing this, you know, like, the first maybe 10, 15 hours, and I'm like, oh, you know, it's, I feel like there's nothing to do in the beginning, we just don't have much unlocked yet, but now we're getting to the point where we really, we really have to actually decide what we want to do with our time, because we have way more options than we used to. Let's go check on Hifumi. I can't remember if we need to get a certain stat high enough. We may need, like, a higher level of charm or something to start with her, so we may not even be able to do this yet. Hey, hey! <sighs> yeah, so we need a little bit more charm, so we can't do anything with her yet. So, uh, I guess we're hanging out with Coffee and Curry Dad tonight. Yeah, okay, that's fine, though. We haven't done much with Sojiro in a while. So it won't hurt to rank him up. Do I have a persona to match him? Yeah, he's, he's Hierophant, I think, so I think we're good. Just, wow, let's just look at him again real quick. <laughs> Alright, I'm done. Let's hang out with Coffee Dad, see what he's up to. Yeah. We haven't gotten far with him yet, I think we only have Sojiro up to like, I think he's like three. 
Maybe four? All right, then. Sedger is like full on coffee master. I really do like his cafe though, it's pretty cool. Medium fine. Of course I'm paying attention, Sojiro. that quality time with dad is over see he's coming around to us slowly he's gonna be he's a little less of a dick now wow we only had him at two we really haven't been right. doing much with Sojiro Is we'll have you. to, uh, we'll have to make a mental note to quit neglecting Coffee Dad. Spend a little more time with him. He's cool. I like his social link. And this, we already heard about this. This is, uh, had Mishima interview the reporter, or I'm sorry, we had Mishima get interviewed by the reporter so we could get Kanashiro's name. They probably could have came up with a better code name than Boy M. Should have put him in there as like, you know, what was the, like, Deep Throat or something like that. <laughs> People are coming around to us though. Wait until Kanashiro change of heart. Everybody's gonna be on, on the Phantom Thief side. Man. Okay. I mean that's basically that's what I was talking about earlier. So if if you hang out with the reporter. Her social link abilities let you lower the security level in a palace, but it's honestly, it seems like one of the most useless abilities to me. Like, you you gotta be really screwing up to get the security level that high that you even need to worry about it. And if you're doing things right, you're doing the whole palace in one day anyway. So, generally, her abilities are just not very useful. So let's see, Makoto's ready, the dock's ready, Uh, Makoto or the Doctor? I think we're gonna do Makoto because I want to get some more of her battle abilities unlocked. Next one should hopefully be Baton Pass. Yeah, we definitely need to get Baton Pass. Let's grab a... we don't have a Priestess Persona. We also don't have a Death Persona. We should probably grab one of each before we hang out with the Doc. Yeah, let's do that real quick. Let's run to Shibuya. And I'm just gonna grab... The reason we're doing this is because if you hang out with a confidant while you have a, a persona that matches their arcana, you'll get bonus you? points towards leveling up their link. So, we'll grab a priestess. I hope we have a priestess. We should somewhere. We've, we've already fused a lot of shit. I think we have most of the arcanas covered. So, we'll grab a priestess out of the compendium, and we'll grab a... We'll grab a death for the doctor. And then we'll we'll, just, we'll keep playing the, the dating sim here. You'd like to read the compendium? Read here. So, I oh, was probably just do it by Arcana. Uh, priestess. We'll just grab Silky. This persona, you'll withdraw this persona. This is I mean, your we're going to we're going to pitch these when we're done cuz they're just going to waste persona slots. So, we'll grab the cheapest ones we have. We should have a cheap death persona as well. I believe. 
Yeah, that guy's super cheap. Okay, and we already have Chariot, and we already have Lovers. So that should cover most of our daytime hangouts. It is time, inmate. So, let's see here. Yeah, I think we'll do we'll do Makoto today for sure. Let's uh let's go hang out with her. Hold on just one second. I'll be back in like 30 seconds and then we'll get started on Makoto's. Real short break. Last night, I'm all dried out today. I'm a super, super dry boy, so I've been I'm sitting here chugging water while I'm playing. <laughs> okay. So let's go see what Makoto's up to. It's like, so I know I just kind of I kind of flipped through it real quick, but it says when you get that thing that says I feel like I can become co closer, and then it lists your persona name. That's, that's the bonus point you get for having a Persona that matches the Arcana. So generally, especially now that we have a lot of slots, we want to try and... We, we want to try and keep our Personas matched up with the people we want to work on the social links for. It's just, it's the same thing as everything else, is the entire... <laughs> the entire game outside of the palaces and mementos is basically about time management. You know, so if you want to get a lot done, you want to do it as efficiently as possible. And I mean, we're not going to completely min-max this. You know, I don't have a guide sitting here next to me or anything with all the answers to the questions or anything like that, but we do want to try and at least get as get as much bang for a buck as we can. Yes. So, Makoto's trying to, uh, she's trying to keep tabs on another student from our school that she's been hearing rumors about. for like a maid cafe, I guess. Thank you very much. Okay, so now we at least have baton pass. I mean, that's that's pretty crucial right. to have. It kind of sucks having a party member who you can't baton pass to or from. So we're good for next time we're doing some, you know, next time we're hmm. in mementos or in a palace. I don't think it's a salon. 
Investigator, do a little bit of creeping. Ah, you're back. Hey. <laughs> that's that's a good way to put it. All right. Um, let's see what we want to do this evening. I have to work on our charm. So we have with ah uh, the fortune tellers there tonight. We also have Mishima. Um, let's go to Shinjuku. If we can start the fortune teller tonight, I think we'll do that first. Uh, we'll worry about Mishima a little bit later. So it's like I said, this is gonna cost us, uh, to start the social link costs us 100 grand. And she basically rips this off. <laughs> Greetings. But hers is pretty useful. She really can't see the future. An inmate locked away in a lonely cell. That's impossible. So here it is. <laughs> Buy the magical woo woo necklace. For only the low, low price of a hundred thousand yen. What do you say? What a great deal. Is that so? So, we do have to buy the stupid necklace. You have to buy it to start the social link. It's just the way this goes is so we come back to the we come back to LeBlanc and he's gonna give us he's gonna give us five hundred thousand yen. And then it's like wow, she really did it. It's so impressive. So we, we go we go buy the stupid stone, and that's how you actually start the social link. Coffee oh, Dad yeah. hooking us up heavy, five k. on you. Hey. That's incredible. Oh, now we're going to die. We got to buy the we got to buy no. the magical necklace. Too bad Sojro didn't give us 100,000 yen. So we, we got money to burn, so we'll, we'll buy the stupid necklace. Hers is pretty useful. If you're kind of like right on the edge of leveling up a social link, but you're not quite there yet, she can kind of give you a little boost to push you over the hump. Do 
you know the answer? I do not remember this one, I don't think. Maybe gold? Let me check the, uh... Yeah, okay. This is Just it. kind of double check my work here. Exactly. Working on All right. charm and guts. I, uh. <laughs> thanks. I wanna get, uh, I wanna get started on Hifumi's social link. Hers is pretty useful. It's like passive benefits in battle, generally. So, we wanna get started on Hifumi's, and I wanna get started on the gun shop guy, too. So we need to we need to get our charm up. We can get our charm up at the bathhouse, and I think there's certain days a week where we get a bigger bonus there, which I think is like Wednesday and maybe Monday. So we'll have to start hitting up the bathhouse, get that charm up, so we can uh, we'll go hang out with the doc today. Looks like that's really that's really all we got right now. It's ready to rank up. So, let's do the dock today, and then we'll, uh, we'll see about tonight. The catch is still on the chalkboard in our classroom. Tonight, we'll either, uh, maybe we'll either go to the bathhouse, or we'll go to, or we'll do the fortune teller. So, let's see. I think it's, like... Oh yeah, it's only open at night. But there's like two nights a week where you get bonus charm in there. So we'll uh that's that's the the Persona games it's a lot about You really won't know how to do all this the first time. Unless you're using like a guide and you're trying to min max, which I I wouldn't recommend you use a guide or try really hard to get everything done the first time through. That's kind of the whole point of the new game plus. Like they almost intend for you to play this game twice. Oh no, I need more charm to keep working on the dock too. So, we're kind of stuck here. I guess we're going to hang out with On today. I think we're kind of stuck on everything. Yeah, and I mean like I don't, I don't remember if there's anything in 5, but like in 4, Persona 4, there's a there's a social link that's almost impossible. Like, you basically can't max it out the first time. The the kid that's the tower social link, by the time you can even start it, it's so late in the game that you're going to have a hell of a time trying to get it maxed out. Like, you're you're almost expected... You're almost expected to play it twice. Oh, um, Mishima has a, a new request for us. We should probably hang out with him one of these days. So we'll go see what On's up to. Since really, <laughs> there's no one else we can hang out with right now. So we really do. We gotta get cracking on that charm. And uh, we'll just have to wait for now. Oh yeah. Yeah. Charm and guts. Because now we got Fumi and the Doc. Okay. Let's see. I think we can take on to. Where can we take her now? Can we take her to? No. Sorry. I just want to go anywhere fun. Take her to Shibuya. Okay, let's get going. Yeah, we'll take on to the buffet. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're getting super fat. Look at all that stuff. Look at it. There's like a chocolate fountain back there. It looks like a vanilla fountain. And maybe, I don't know what the one on the right would be. Is that like a caramel? <laughs> it looks like a caramel fountain or something. Yes. So 
There's all kinds of good shit here. Seriously? Oh, she get oh look, there it is. We got a chocolate fountain. Oh yeah, that probably is it. Uh, I don't think we need to. Uh, we'll give her one. I don't know if we need it yet to get her ranked up, but we'll give it to her. We bought two of them, so it's not like it's gonna hurt. She's Aunt's the only one who really likes the the candy anyway. So. No point in holding on to it, I guess. Yep, so she'll rank up for sure next time. And we'll figure out tonight. Because we still need to go see Mishima. Ah, you're back. Oh, now we can finally finish. This is. Ryuji's been stuck for a while. We've been waiting for his social link to uh, progress. So we can finally do that. I guess we'll do that. So we've been waiting for a while to get that done. This will give us a new part of the map, too. All right. Ah, oh, we're just a little too late. Maybe we could have taken on there on a date. And I know it's been a long time since we did anything with Ryuji. It's been like over a month of in-game time, I think. But, uh, so this is the teacher who's going to be taking over the track team. In case anyone's watching who doesn't. It's like, if, if you haven't been watching in a while, you probably have no idea where we are with Ryuji's social link. So Yamauchi is the guy who's going to be taking over the track team. And he's supposed to be like, basically as big of a dickhead as Kamoshida. So Ry Ryuji's worried that something's up. And we're here spying on him. So he doesn't really have the track team's best interests at heart. He's just looking out for himself, pretty much. <laughs> Shujin just can't get a break. That's got to be the unluckiest goal on the whole planet. Just nothing ever seems to go right there. You know, first we had the, the teachers sexually harassing people. We got students getting caught up in the mob. We got Kamoshita Jr. trying to fuck over the track team again, just so we can make himself famous. Not a good time to be a Shujin student, for sure. Man, this guy really has some, some big fucking aspirations for himself. So, Ryuji was right. This guy is absolutely up to some shit. He's trying to turn them all against each other. So, yeah, really not much better than Kamoshida. It's just Kamoshida minus all the... minus the raping. There's a lot going on here. Damn it. I'm sure Ryuji won't overreact at all. Any 
again. <laughs> that might be the most mature thing Ryuji's ever said since we started hanging out with him. <laughs> yeah. There we go. I think Ryuji's like seven or eight now. Ah, oh, this is a great ability, too. So, the way this skill works is if you get an ambush and your level is, is uh, higher than the enemy's level, you have a chance of the battle just being like you don't even have to fight, it just ends. All right. Pretty useful. I didn't expect we'd get that this early on. <laughs> Generally hanging out with our social links, we end up getting pretty fat. We just we just go and eat all over Tokyo. <laughs> okay. So we gotta remember though, we gotta start working on our charm. Because it's it's falling behind. might start having to like double team it we'll pick up some dvds and we'll do the bathhouse or something uh we already went to mementos we don't really need to go back there yet so mm. yeah we already spent our time in there i think we, i think all our requests are done so i don't even i don't even know what on's talking about i think all all our requests are complete at the moment I'll have to double check. Mm. Let's take a quick look here. Yeah, all the requests are done. So, so we were farming them for money. So we have no real reason to go back there now. Uh, use K and Makoto want to hang. We'll hang out with Makoto. I don't really care about Use K. We gotta remember to go back and see the fortune teller as well. Let's see if we can get. Uh, well, let's check a couple things. Let's see if there's any new books, and then we'll look at the DVDs, what can I get you? and we'll see what movies playing. We definitely need some charm. I think we can maybe pick up. I think we can pick up a DVD. Yeah, that'll give us charm. Let's. We'll rent this. And we might do that tonight. But I think we're going to hang out with Makoto during the day today. And then we'll check the bathhouse tonight. If if it's a good night for the bathhouse, we'll do that. Cuz when it's raining, I don't think the I don't think the fortune teller's out when it's raining anyway. Uh, we've already seen this one. Okay, so we're done. We're done with that. Um uh, so, let's go see Makoto. So we're gonna go talk to the girl that she was trying to keep tabs on in Shinjuku. Excuse me. She's working as some kind of like shady... She might be, like, handing out happy endings or something. If <laughs> we don't really know yet. Hmm. I see. working like a maid cafe letting creepy old dudes get all up on her
<laughs> well, um... hmm? I have no idea who Bucci Maru is. <laughs> uh, I want to do beat boot, but I don't. I don't think that's the. I don't think that's the good answer. I. I really want to say beat boop though. Hmm. Some of the some of the dick answers are pretty funny. Now we have another party member who can bail us out if we screw the negotiation up. All right. I think we got to see. Uh, I think we got to see Ryuji bail us out in Kanashiro's palace. So at least now, you know. I'll see you later. No, you can. You can romance them all, <laughs> if you want to. Uh, you know, you'll get a special cutscene if you do more than one. We won't be able to do all of them. We could we could do at least a couple of them though. We can start building up our our ho squad. I guess I guess ho squad is inappropriate. We could we could build up our harem our harem of women. <laughs> okay, so we have a new request from Mishima. We need to finish the fortune teller. We also have a DVD to watch. Um, I want to check the bathhouse real quick. <laughs> we could try and do the harem this time. I, I did, uh, I picked Makoto my first playthrough. But maybe we can still get Makoto. We'll just, we'll just wife everybody. Oh. Okay, so Thursday is one of the days where we get bonus charm. Uh, I don't think we're going to do that tonight, though. We have a lot of other stuff going on. But so at least we know Thursday's one of the nights. Maybe it's Monday and Thursday are the bonus charm days. But we definitely do need to start working on our charm. So we can, I mean, there's, we got the dock. And, uh, uh who else? The dock, Hafumi, and eventually we're going to need more charm for Makoto as well. So let's see here. Let's buy the, let's buy the stupid stone first. And then once we get the stone, <laughs> we'll hang out with... I think this wastes the rest of our night, so we're probably not going to get to hang out with Mishima tonight. So we just pissed away a whole bunch of money on a stupid rock. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Charged with a happiness aura. <laughs> Yeah, so we spent a hundred grand and we wasted the rest of our night. Not a very good deal. Ah, you're back. Hey, hey. Hey. So I think our stone is already For real? Stone's already dead. Yep. We got ripped off bigly. Whoa! 
<laughs> Don't worry, Sojiro. Just a bit salty. Oh, you don't even need to go out and get some. We can loan you some. Hmm. Come on, Mona. Even you should be able to figure this out. No way. Hey. So we got swindled. Yep, give me, give me those salty emotes. So we, we didn't have a good time with the fortune teller. <laughs> but that's all right. Oh man, this is our last book. We've been getting lots of days on the train here. So, we still need to hit up uh, Mishima to get our next mementos request. What are your thoughts? And we need to uh, we need to keep working on our charm. All right. Oh, they got some new items at the diner. Okay, so now we can we can get the tea while we're studying. That'll give us charm on top of a knowledge boost. So we can do like a twofer. Wow. That could be potentially helpful right now, seeing as we seem to be not very charming. You know, you would think we got this we got this cat rolling around in our backpack. You would think uh You would think the cat would be enough of a of a charm booster, but apparently nobody likes Mona. And we should have On ready to rank up. So maybe we'll do that. Well, shall we begin? I do not think I remember this one. What is the answer? Like, at all. Uh, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna cheat and ask the internet. Okay. Yeah, I, I do not remember this question at all. Very good. I'm not even sure what Bowsy is. Or Bowsy? I'm not sure how the hell you even say that. But I did not remember that one at all. Getting smart. Getting real smart. All right. <laughs> One question at a time. No, cheating doesn't do anything. It's that's just the that's just the the network features. You can't use it on the test though, so you got to remember the answers for the tests or use a guide. Since when I played it the first time I was playing on that PS3, it was jailbroken and I couldn't get online. So I didn't even I didn't even get to use the network stuff the first time. So I'm gonna make use of it this time around. Yep. Okay. Let's see who wants to hang today. <laughs> All right, we got on for sure. My body needs sweet. Yeah, so we're stalled on the doctor. Uh, so during the day, on's all we have today. So let's let's go hang with on. Uh, we'll get her up to seven. 
Ah, oh, there we go. That'll make our lives easier, too. Chance to seduce the enemy during negotiation and steer discussion. Okay. So, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go give on the sweets. If we, uh... Mona's super in love with On, so I kind of want to—I kind of want to wife On just to make Mona mad. <laughs> so, listen, Mona, you remember all those times you missed when we had you in the palace? Well, guess what, bitch? I got your woman. Starting to fill this map out slowly. All right. doesn't remember it was pretty early on uh on is a model like an amateur model i guess one of the first social link things we did with on is we went to a we went to a photo shoot with her and this chick here mika is mika's like a fucking cutthroat like full-on backstabber and she's trying to basically sabotage on's career and even though we tried to warn on i think she's gonna wow. get she's gonna get wrecked again Time to turn on the waterworks. Yes! Give him the blue steel. <laughs> guy's going ham on that camera. Um. Time to go. <laughs> oh, I got smoked. Not even close. Thank you. 
learning all about modeling now. So now we need to figure out what we want to do tonight. All right. Um, we still have to hang out with Mishima, uh. and we need charm. So we have a DVD for charm. We also have the bathhouse. Uh, Bye. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see who wants to do what tonight. Oh, we got to go back and see the damn fortune teller too, and be super mad about getting ripped off. Ah. Uh. Back. There's a lot going on here. Um, I can't do that yet. What do we got going on in Shinjuku? I guess let's go deal with the fortune teller. We'll get to you, Mishima, real soon. I promise. I keep selling you out. Sorry, buddy. possessed by a demon. If only if only we knew somebody who could like do stuff to people's hearts or something. Thirty-six installments. This lady's fucking ruthless. For real? Sorry, lady. We're better at this than you are. G goodness gracious! Okay, so we have another another mementos thing. Does this use our day up still? Yeah, son of a bitch. Yep, so we'll still have to go see Mishima. I guess we're gonna have to spend a day in mementos here too. So we can get moving on the social link. We need to do that. Hi. So until we do that mementos request, we can't do anything else with the fortune teller. Oh, Kawakami's giving us a day hey. off. What do you want to do? Uh, I guess we'll make some lockpicks. We don't have anything to read. Too bad we can't bust out our DVDs in class. Cool. 
Don't mind me, Kawakami. Just gonna put my just put my TV up here. Ah, shit. We're out of we're out of yarn. What are we gonna make? I guess we'll I guess we'll just make some freaking. I guess we'll just make some of these. Okay. Damn. I didn't realize we were out of that. We're still out of the shit. I figured we would have picked some up last time. Hmm. Hey. Hmm. You got it. Thanks, Kawakami. We'll get like Kawakami, Makoto, on the doctor. We'll get like a. Hey. We've got a whole bunch of girls in the squad here. Makoto and Ryuji aren't ready to rank up yet. Use K. Well, maybe we should run into Mementos and do that request real quick. I kind of feel like we're almost wasting time. But, uh. There's not too much else going on right now. Hold on one second here. I just want to see. And, uh, we could actually we could get some more money off that boss, too. That boss is confusable. So, what the hell. Let's, uh, let's get a mementos. Let's get that request done. I should write something. And we'll maybe get a little bit of cash. Replenish our, you know, <laughs> we just wasted a hundred grand on the stupid stone. So... Let's go. Let's go do that real quick. We won't spend too long in mementos. It'll be in and out. We'll uh, we'll fight that boss and then so we'll just farm him for like ten minutes. We'll get a little bit of cash real quick and then we'll get back to uh, get back to the social links and stuff. Everyone's here. We still need to go see Mishima. Ah oh, shit! You know what? We shouldn't do this yet because I think Mishima has a request for us. So, let's not do this yet. I'm, <laughs> I'm glad I can't stop talking to myself. Because if Mishima has another one for us, then we're going to need to go back anyway. So, let's, uh, let's do something during the day, and then we'll go see Mishima tonight. And then we'll go to Mementos, so we should have two things we can do next time. The question is, who do we want to hang out with? I guess Yusuke will rank up. We'll go hang out with Yusuke. And then tonight we'll go see Mishima. I was, wait, I thought he was in the underground walkway. What the hell is it? Maybe I just have to go down here. No, Yusuke's around here somewhere. Where the hell is he hiding? I think he might be over here. No? Where the hell is Yusuke at? I honestly can't remember now. Oh, over here. There he is. Creepy fucker just hiding in the corner. Hmm. By the way. <laughs> okay. Yes, then tonight. Please hear me out. <laughs> this is the painting use came made of mementos. And it's pretty cool looking, I have to say. <laughs> Indeed. So anyway, we'll see Mishima tonight. We'll see if he has another request for us. And then uh then we'll at least have two things to do in, in mementos. To tell the truth. <laughs> but tomorrow is Sunday, so we gotta make sure we go to the juice bar before we go to mementos. Alright. 
Podcast. See you. See you, Yusuke. Nice knowing you. I can't remember how far I got him last time. I think I only got him like four or five. I didn't spend a lot of time with Yusuke my first uh, playthrough. You're back. Okay. Uh, let's see what's going on in Shinjuku. Yeah, Mishima's there. So let's go see him. We'll hopefully get our next request. The reporter is pretty awful. I feel a little bad for him. What do you think? Going on a mandate with Mishima. Hopefully we should have two. All right. Maybe we should do a little digging or something first. <laughs> Mashima's really starting to let things get in his head a little bit. No, no. <laughs> Damn it. See you around. Uh, so maybe it's not technically a request yet. Ryuji is Ryuji's in between, so hopefully if we hang out with him doing this, next time we actually hang out, he'll rank up. So yeah, we'll go we'll go fishing with Ryuji. Alright. I hope I'm not gonna miss out the miss out on the freaking I forgot about Sunday though. So it's not until nighttime, so can I go to the juice bar first still? Or does it take my whole damn day up? Might not have thought this through the whole way. We'll see. Hey. Teachers ragging on us. For real? Yeah, 
You would think Ryuchi would be a great fisherman. Good though. So we got some free points for Kawakami, and we got some free points for uh, for Ryuji too. Uh, we still have our evening time, so let's check the shopping channel. And I mean, what the hell? We'll buy it. Doesn't hurt. I think it just cures burn. Then we'll, uh, man, we rented that DVD. We're not even going to get to watch it before it's due at the rate we're going here. So we need to go to the juice bar. Oh, and it's Sunday, so the politician wants to hang out. So yeah, we're not going to, we're not going to be watching our DVD tonight either. But let's go to the juice bar real quick. We'll hang out with, uh, Tora. I don't know how you're supposed to pronounce that. Oh, oh, Juru. Nasty Ojuru. <laughs> Time to get chugging. Oh, yeah. He really did take it like a champ, though. All right. Okay, let's hang out with Tora. going here. We're not even going to get to watch this DVD before we have to return it. I'm still waiting. I'm not sure if I want to go into Mementos yet. Because, uh, Mishima, it sounds like he has that other request for us. So if I go in just to do this one for the fortune teller, then, uh, I, see. I feel like we may have to end up going back right after. Yes. believe in you, Yoshi. You can do it. Thank you. All right. Uh, 
Okay, so... I shall ask you again another time. We're running out of days here until the change of heart as well. I mean, honestly, maybe what we'll do is maybe we'll just wait. Because we're already getting to the point where the change of heart is close. And once that happens, more of Mementos is going to open up. So if we're going to go in and do this thing for the fortune teller... Hey! Uh... If we're going to go in and do this with the fortune teller, we might as well just, uh... Oh. We might as well wait until we have more to explore, too. So we can go in and do the fortune teller, maybe Mishima's request, and we'll have the whole new section to explore. Instead of going in just to do one thing. We need to get some new books. We're running out of crap to read. Wow. All this did was give us a new map location. And honestly, I think we might have unlocked that one normally anyway, later on, so... All right. Oh, well. Oh, my God. I think it's actually the third one. It's like a, it's like a Roman, a Roman ruler, because it's like Julius and Augustus, and I think one of them was mad because his month didn't have as many days as the next one, so he made his month have an extra day. But let's double check that. Yeah. Okay. That's correct. Some of these make some pretty good Jeopardy questions. I feel like. Yeah, Julius and Augustus. I do remember some of these. Imagine you're such a powerful dude, you can add an entire fucking day to the year just because you feel like it. <laughs> nice going. Oh man, we got midterms coming up soon too, huh? I didn't even think about that. I I hope I hope uh, level three knowledge is enough. I think it is, because I mean, you need level two knowledge for the first exam. So I think level three knowledge for the next exam. There's there's four exams total. Well, it looks like nobody wants to hang today, so I guess we're gonna go. We're gonna go study. I think we might as well just get return that DVD. It doesn't seem like we're gonna be watching it anytime soon. I guess if we're going to watch a DVD, we'll just go check one out that night and watch it. Because right now we're just going to end up having late fees. Whoops. I wanted to go to Central Street. Yeah, I guess we'll just, uh... I guess we'll just return the DVD. We'll go study. Since it's rainy. We can get some charm. From the, uh, the fruit... The fruit tea. So we'll do that. Mona gets mad if you return a DVD that you haven't even watched yet. But we only have like two days left, so we'll just wait. If we decide we're going to watch one, we'll just come back and rent it that night. Because right now, it seems like we've got too much other stuff going on. Let's get that, uh, let's get the charm. We can use it. Wow. Oh. Hmm. I think Monday might be one of the nights, too, where All we right. can, uh, hey. that may be one of the nights we get bonus charm at the bathhouse. So maybe we'll do that tonight. All right. I think we're gonna we're probably gonna wrap up here pretty soon. We're getting to we're getting at a pretty long stream here. Right. It's been three and a half hours. Wanna head back? 
Let's go, uh, let's go scope out the bathhouse. I think this is gonna be the last day. Ah, you're back. Let's see if Mishima has anything for us yet. No. Everybody's getting paranoid. Positive again. How many days do we have left? Five days left. Who wants to hang? Sojuro. Can't do anything else in Shinjuku right now. Can't do anything there either. Okay, let's go scope out the bathhouse. Let's see if tonight's a let's see if tonight's a bonus charm night. And then this will be where we're gonna call it, I think, after today. Oh, I gotta hit up the vending machines real quick. Forgot about that. Let's go to the arcade. We'll hit up Shinjuku, and then we'll come back and do the bathhouse real fast. I think it's Monday and Thursday, so tonight might be our night. Let's take a peek here and see. Get that medicinal bath. Or I guess medicinal. <laughs> I don't know you want to say it. Alright. Yeah, okay. Monday and Thursday. Let's take a bath. Get super charming. Oh yeah, look at that old man over there by the faucet. Whoa. Super charming. I'm gonna right. actually just level it up. Want to head back? is overwhelming. It's gonna be a pretty big deal. Indeed. Now they're still trying to get us into mementos, but I don't I don't see any good reason to go in there yet with only one request. Soon enough, we'll have a whole nother section we can explore. So we got four days until the change of heart. Ryuji's ready to rank up. Uh, yeah, I mean, four days till the change of heart, and once that happens, we'll have, uh, we'll have more stuff to do anyway. We'll have a whole new section. So, I think, uh... Let's do it. I think we're gonna stop here for now. We're at like three and a half hours. There's a good bit of stuff going on. We had a lot of, a lot of story type stuff today. So let's stop here and then, uh, well, tomorrow we'll do. We'll, tomorrow probably the same thing. More social links. We'll get to see the change of heart, hopefully. So, uh, oh, that's it. Check back tomorrow. Thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate the, uh, the follows we got today, too. So, I'll see you later.